بحرر في يوندسز أميد دان في أميد دان دات كوم تودا أول هاب أنادر بيسر أوف جو برو تيبس أن تريكس فيديو أن أول تاك أبوت هاو تو سيب فايلز فرام يور فون تو جو برو كلاود إف ذس إز يور فرس تايم أو ريبيت فيزيت ثانك يو فور يور سبورت أن ذس شانل أم أول أسترين يو أن ديفرن أيديز If you appreciate variety, please go ahead and come back for more. If you're only looking for GoPro videos, there will be links in the description box below. So GoPro has a subscription service which uh, lets you save uh, unlimited files to GoPro Cloud. And you can do that via GoPro Quick App, which I have it uh, right here. And you can actually save files from your phone, uh, from GoPro cameras, and also from your computer or laptop. In this video today, I'll only concentrate on how you can save files from your phone to GoPro Cloud. So these files can be anything. It doesn't have to be actually, you know, from from GoPro. For example, if you're recording something or if you're, you know, taking pictures from your camera, you can save that to GoPro Cloud service, and you can do that from your phone. And you have to do it actually manually, and it's not going to, uh, you know, be saved automa automatically. So. Each time, let's say you're doing taking a picture or doing a video, so you have to decide like you know which one you'd like to save it to the GoPro Cloud, and that's what I'll show you today. So I have a feeling that GoPro did it on purpose. Uh, it doesn't have the feature or option to you know do unlimited backup from your phone uh, because you know uh, they don't want uh, to save everything you are doing with your phone. Uh, but they offer the service via GoPro. So if you set up your GoPro to backup automatically, then it saves everything to GoPro Cloud from uh, GoPro cameras. But if you'd like to save from a uh, computer, laptop, or uh, phone. Then you have to do it manually each time. So, what I'm going to do, uh, I'll just you know take a picture of uh, the GoPro I have here, just to show you how you can do it. And I'm not taking any uh, video picture or I'm not recording any video because it takes longer to save. So just to you know uh, make things easier, I'm just going to take uh, a picture, uh, which will be much faster to save. So let's say we have here uh, these two GoPro, and I'm going to take a picture right. Uh, here and you can see that you know we took a picture which is right here and I'm just going to minimize this and we'll go to our uh, GoPro app so we have the GoPro app right now so whenever you're opening GoPro this is what the screen you're going to get uh, this is kind of like like the main you know home page or home screen of a GoPro quick app so here you're going to go to media which is the second option from the lower left so if you click on media then here you're going to see three different tabs under all media so one is the app one is the cloud and one is the phone so cloud is already you know the media or files is saved on GoPro cloud uh, which is right here so these are already saved and then we have here uh, phone is where you have all your files uh, which you haven't saved yet or whatever like you, know, you have on your phone uh, on your phone's hard drive uh, these are all like you know video and uh, picture files and app is actually is kind of a storage folder inside GoPro app where you have to first transfer your files in order to save it to the cloud uh, but you can just do it uh, by going to the phone tab because you know we just took the picture via phone camera so this is going to be under phone uh, tab uh, because the phone or the picture is actually stored on the phone and you're gonna have to just find that picture or video you took right now so here if I take a look here I can see that you know these are the pictures I just took so if I click on here and here we have the picture so in order to save this file to GoPro Cloud all you have to do is click here upper right corner and you can see that it says media imported so what it means that GoPro transferred this picture to GoPro inside GoPro app which is going to be right here uh, let me just go back here uh, under GoPro app and then from here it's saving to the cloud so you cannot save directly to the cloud from your phone manually uh, actually you could uh, but it's just like you know the way GoPro works is that uh, it transfers everything first to the GoPro app folder and then from there it takes to the cloud or saves to the cloud so whenever you're saving let's say video or picture files from your phone it doesn't go to cloud directly 
it goes to the app section first which is app folder and then from there it goes to the cloud now if you look very carefully uh, you're gonna see kind of a cloud icon blinking so you can see that this one blinking right here this one is blinking right here so what it means that this is still saving to the cloud it hasn't been completed yet uh, for example if you take a look at these files you can see the same cloud icon on the upper left but you're gonna see uh, let me just bring this closer and you're gonna see that you know there's no kind of blinking arrow in between or in the middle but if you're taking a look here you're going to see that there's kind of like an arrow in the middle so it means that you know this file is being saved to GoPro Cloud from your phone now once it's done it's going to be like you know steady uh, it's not going to blink anymore but I, I found that this kind of like you know arrow is sometimes is glitchy uh, I have had video files which are saved to the cloud long before but they were still blinking so this is a picture file uh, this should be a very small file and even it might already be you know saved to GoPro uh, cloud so let me just click and see if I can see anything here and I'm just going to refresh and actually no it is not there yet uh, but you can see that it's there now so it has been saved to GoPro Cloud and now if you delete that picture from phone or your like you know GoPro media app uh, section then it still is going to be in the cloud so for example I'm just going to click on it and I'm going to hit the delete button and you can see that you know I deleted this picture which we just took and it should be now under GoPro Cloud because it's already saved. So if you go there, then you can see that, you know, the picture is still there because it already went to GoPro Cloud. So that's how you save uh, manually from your phone to GoPro Cloud. Uh, and in this video, I only talked about how to save manually from your phone to the GoPro Cloud. But, uh, you know, uh, if you're trying to save from GoPro Camera, or computer or laptop to GoPro Cloud. That's a different process, and hopefully I'll make some videos on those in the future. So that's all for today. Thank you for watching this video. There'll be more videos coming up, so I'll see you shortly. Thank you.